Welcome to the Solstice Observations for 2021. Some folks are not super confident with exactly how to do this, so I did it today and this is my recording of how to do. First, get a stick and measure it. I have measured mine. You want something that you can prop up very, very straight, so I made sure that my board, just a piece of wood, is very square. Um, there I am holding it with a little square to make sure I'm holding it perfectly straight up and down. And also, I'm going to zoom in here and show you that this is a little before noon. So the compass is showing that the light does not quite point north and south yet. This is at 1239, and here I measure the length of the shadow. I'm a few minutes before noon, so I'm going to take another measurement. As we get a little closer to noon, you can see the shadow is getting closer to that north-south line. And here at 1249, I am taking the measurement again to measure the length of the shadow. Still not quite noon. Here we are at 1255 and you can see the shadow is lined up perfectly with the compass. So here's the official measurement that I want for today. The measurement that we want is right at the culmination point or local noon. We can get that from suncalc.org. That's when the shadow is the shortest and also when the compass shows that it aligns perfectly north and south. And here I am just a little past local noon at 103 where I'm measuring one last time to just to show how much impact we get if you're a little bit off on your time. I took a few measurements before noon, during noon, and afternoon to see the impact of that. As you can see here, all these measurements are within one degree of each other. Finally, a few folks have expressed some difficulty finding that local noon time. Here's how I'm gonna do it, suncalc.org. Now, if you're running this on a, a PC, a laptop or something like that, it's quite easy to use, but I gather that some people rely completely on a, on a, a mobile device and maybe it's not as easy. Here's what you do, you put in your time, in your, your location right there. I'm gonna put Los Angeles, Cal there you go. Los Angeles, California. That will set my latitude and longitude. And then it will tell me for my date, let's put the date to today. Uh, it tells me the culmination right there. So 1254 is the culmination time. You can click it to see. Uh, and we're looking for an altitude today of 79.38 degrees. Um, that's, what, that's what you're expecting to get here in Los Angeles. If you're in a different location, you can put the city or you can enter the latitude and longitude directly right here. Now, for some people, they maybe are on a mobile device. Maybe this isn't as easy to use there. Um, feel free to email me or put into the comments, hey, I need help finding my, uh, my culmination time. I will do this for you. Uh, happy to do it, no problem at all. You'll just need to give me your latitude and longitude or just give me the city if you don't know that and um, we'll plug it in here for you. So get on out there and get some observations, send them on in, and let's see how it turns out. Have a great Father's Day, have a great solstice, get out with the kids and do a science.